everyone, it's Ellen again and you're watching Make Up Your Mind. Today I wanted to talk about the Cinderella collection. It actually came out at MAC today. Of course, I was there at 10 a.m. when the store opened to snag up all the items because you know how that goes. They go by really quick. I wasn't able to get everything, but I do have a lot of things that are similar. Um, so I got the things that are limited, of course, like the lipsticks, amongst other things. So I wanted to show you what I got today. I got the beauty powder in Mystery Princess right here. Love, love, love it. And I also got the Studio Eye Gloss in Lightly Taupe. As you can see, I used it already. Here's one lipstick. Um, all the lipsticks are lusters, and I'll show you the swatches after I show you the lipsticks. This one's Free as a Butterfly. And this one's Royal Ball. So one's slightly pink peachy, and uh, the other one is like a shimmery pale pink, like extremely pale pink. Now both of the lipsticks are lusters, which are very, very sheer and extremely lustrous. But anyways, um, I have everything that I've purchased today, I have on. So I wanted to show you guys how I achieved this look with all the Cinderella products that I purchased because I'm so excited about it. I'm gonna go into the tutorial and just show you how I achieved this nice, soft, ball-ready look. Okay, let's get into it. So first I'm gonna start by applying my concealer underneath my brow with my 266 brush. And then I'm gonna blend the concealer down with my 217. After I've done that, I'm going to apply Omega, that's in the Cinderella palette, to my crease, and then Quarry, just to add some depth. Now I'm going to take my Bare Minerals BB Eyes in Elegant Taupe and prime my eyes with that. Then I'm going to press Satin Taupe, again in the Cinderella palette, onto my lid with my 242 brush. Then take any pearl color eye pencil and line your waterline. And then line my top waterline with Smolder Eye Coal by MAC. And then apply Vapor to the inner corner of my lid with my 242 brush. And then I'm going to take my NARS pencil in Via Di Martelli and line it on my bottom lash line. And then taking the dark purple from the MAC palette and brushing it against the line I just made. Then taking the same color, brushing it into the outer corner of my lid and into my crease and taking my 217 brush and blending it down. Then take the Studio Eye Gloss in Lightly Taupe and press it onto the center of my lid with my finger. I'll finish off the eye after I put the rest of my makeup on. But first I'm going to highlight with my NARS concealer in Custard and my Beauty Blender. I'm going to highlight beneath my eyes and through my temple. And blend it out with my Beauty Blender, of course. Then I'm going to take the concealer and apply it down the center of my face and blend it down with the Beauty Blender again. Come, now I'm coming back to life. And then I'm also going to highlight underneath where I would contour. Then I'm going to take my trusty banana powder and apply the powder everywhere I applied my highlight. Underneath my eye and down the center of my face. Then I'm going to grab that 242 brush again and touch up the highlights I made with vapor underneath my eye. But then I'm going to apply it on the outer corner of my eye. Now for sculpting, I'm going to take Max Sculpt Powder and sculpt the sides of my nose and around the bulbous part of my nose. And then of course, on my cheeks. And down the side of my jawline. Doing it again on the other side. Then I'm going to take my new beauty powder in Mystery Princess and apply it to my highlight. Then I'm going to take Lovejoy in their Mineralized Blush by MAC. Now to the lip. First I'm going to prep my lip with MAC Stripped Down Lip Liner. Applying it on my lip line and on the majority of my lip. Then I'm going to take Plum Liner and apply it to my lip line just to add some depth. And then take the Cinderella lipstick in Free as a Butterfly and apply it over it. And since I didn't buy the gloss in the collection, I'm going to use Buxom's lip gloss in Becca. Finish off the look, I'm going to apply my primer on my mascara. 
and then apply my favorite mascara by Benefit, They're Real, and then finish it off with MAC's Hot and Naughty Lash, which I love because it gives me that extra drama I need for my lashes. And after some final coats, I'm all done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I'm ready for the ball. So as you can see, this is the finished look. It's a very soft, subtle, smoky eye. Um, very ball ready, very kind of like elegant. And that's what I was trying to achieve, especially with my hair today. I'm a little pearly whirly. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys like the tutorial. I hope you like the outcome and how the makeup looked. I was just really excited and I had to share my excitement with the world. So I hope you guys enjoy this really quick tutorial and a little preview of the makeup if you haven't got it already. I suggest go to the store and grab it, hopefully today. The products are really fun and kind of different and very whimsical. I love everything that I purchased today. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you like and subscribe. And please feel free to comment, ask any questions below. Okay, thank you. Bye, guys.